Are you looking to make more profit on every job? Do you ever think about adding zoning to every installation? You know, homeowners are learning more and more about zoning every day. They've got zoning in their cars, and you've got a light switch in every room of their house. Why not put a thermostat in? Every homeowner has rooms that are also too hot or too cold. Zoning helps you differentiate yourself from your competition who are just selling on price. Zoning can also make you the home and energy saving expert. Hi, I'm Dick Foster, president of Zone First. And today on this zoned house, we're going to show you how to install retrofit zoning on any installation, even this 100-year-old farmhouse. Should we rebuild this one? Leah Swenson is a married mom of two young children who works from home. This summer, as record heat hit much of the country, including here in Minneapolis, the Swenson's 11-year-old air conditioner finally gave up. Desperate for cooling, Leah called her HVAC contractor, Steve Sinke, of Heating Cooling 2. To keep her utility bills low and take advantage of rebates in the federal tax credit, Steve recommended a brand new high-efficiency furnace and air conditioner. So while the family was happy and relieved to have the air conditioning back, they still had one big problem. They weren't comfortable throughout the house. To cool off the second floor, we have to keep the thermostat down really low, which makes us freeze on the lower levels. It just is so uncomfortable and it just seems like such a waste of money and energy. The fact is, when you only have one thermostat in the house, there's just no way you can properly control your heating and cooling to ensure comfort in every room. The only way to solve the Swenson's comfort problem is to zone the heating and cooling system. This is an often missed opportunity for contractors, especially when things get busy with air conditioning changeouts, service calls, and more during a hot summer or a cold winter. Fact is, homeowners are willing to pay extra for better comfort throughout their homes. Many contractors just don't realize this. When we first started talking about zoning, I was really worried about the cost. But once they broke it down for me and I realized how much money we could save on our energy bills, we were sold. It's been a great investment for my family's comfort. What many contractors don't know is that people really want zoning. They just don't know that they can have it in an existing home. Often, they don't even know what to ask for. And with today's wireless thermostats and Zone First retrofit dampers, zoning isn't just for new construction anymore. So I was really excited to hear that we could have it too. So in order to sell it, you really have to tell it. And when you tell them about it, consumer surveys show that 60% of people would buy it. Once they were educated about the comfort and benefits of zoning and how they could save up to 25% on their utility bills, the Swensons decided to go for it. Today, Steve's going to show us just how easy it is to install a Zone First retrofit zoning system. Hi Steve, ready to show us how it's done? Absolutely, Dick. Steve, this looks like a perfect application for zoning. All of our ducts exposed. Yep, we're going to install your retro round dampers in each one of the branch runs. Great. All Bill has to do here is cut a slot in the existing branch run, slide the damper in, and secure it with four screws. We really like how easy they are to wire. We just plug them in, and Zone First even includes a 25-foot cord with every damper. And the LED shows the damper position. We daisy chain the wiring and get up to 10 dampers per zone. We finish the wiring by plugging the dampers into the zone panel. And the thermostats wire to color-coded push-in terminals. I see the uh, LEDs will help you on system status when you go to check the system out. Yes. You also use the wireless receiver down here. Yeah, it saved us a lot of time because we didn't have to fish wires to the second level. Bill, I see you've done some duct modifications here. Right. Originally, this trunk line was extended to here, so we had to shorten it up to accommodate a damper in this branch run. Well, that looks really good. Sometimes minor duct modifications are needed. Here we decided to go with a wireless thermostat because we didn't have a common chase to run a wire to one of the upstairs bedrooms. The wireless stat saves us a ton of time not having to pull wires from the upstairs. If you're ready to start making more money on every job while making your customers happy and comfortable and saving energy, call Zone First today. For a Zone First distributor or contractor near you, visit us on the web at www.zonefirst.com. Thanks for watching this zoned house. Till next time, I'm Dick Foster. Mm -hmm.